Ginger Jester. Heck yeah! This is Star Tropics. Bam bam bam. Haha. -ha. Uh, ooh, this is one of those games that's so old that it uses a select button. Uh, register my name. Uh, I will be Jester. Yeah. Uh, 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 select. Yeah, there we go. See? It uses select. This was the first game I ever owned. Uh, it's not to say the first game I ever played, but, uh, my, my sisters owned the other games, because they were older than me, so I played their games. But this is the first game that I got that was mine. All mine, all mine, all mine. So, fun memories of this game. It's, uh, pretty fun and epic. Uh, one day in summer, you land at Sea Island, where Dr. Jones has his laboratory. Ah, yeah. Ah, uh, music in this game is great. A lot of things about this game is great. Um... So, uh, Mike for Smash. I actually saw someone who made custom art of Mike. The character's name in this game is Mike, your player character. Um, and I made art of him, the, you know, depicting him as a Smash reveal. Welcome to Coral Cola! Thanks, dude. Um... Pig? Oink oink! And then it shows you his butthole. Yep. Mike, you're an ace pitcher, I hear. Show me how to throw a fastball sometime? Welcome to Sea Island. You? Uh, but yeah, there's a lot of similarities in this game to, uh... Legend of Zelda, maybe? I have to hurry. I'm gonna roast a pig for your welcome party. Take that, asshole. Literal asshole. Bum ba dum bum bum. Where do you come from? Americola. Your uncle Dr. Jones is so nice. We call him Dr. J. Oh, last week I met Dr. J. He was very busy solving some strange puzzle. Nice punctuation. Last night I gazed up at the Southern Cross. Suddenly, I saw many shooting stars. Legends say shooting stars are omens of disaster. Oh me, oh my! I think I'm going to die. I heard you were coming. Wanna go fishing? No. You're not even wearing a shirt. <laughs> Why are you wearing a shirt? Is it acceptable to wear a shirt or not? I miss Carl of 1990. Do you think I'm pretty? You are pixels? Have you met our chief yet? He's waiting for you. Nice speedo, dude. Mike, your uncle told me about you. I feel like we are old friends. I don't even know your name. I've been waiting for you. I'm Chief Coil Cola, and a good friend of your uncle. Listen, Mike, I have some bad news. Last night, try not to be too upset, but your uncle, Dr. Jones, has been abducted. We must keep this from the islanders so they don't panic. You are the best hope of rescuing Dr. Jones. I don't know what to do. Can you help? No. You are the best hope of rescuing Dr. Jones. I don't know what to do. Can you help? Yes. Good, you're brave. Take this island yo-yo. You may think this yo-yo is just a toy, but it's very powerful. Mike, you're an ace pitcher. Use it. So basically, uh, that's your main weapon. And they've <laughs> established, I guess, that you're a baseball pitcher. Uh, so it's basically you throw it like you're throwing a baseball. But it's a yo-yo, so it's on a string, so you can just haul it back. So, that's cool. Mike, it looks peaceful around here, but in the dark below, many monsters have appeared these last few years. Don't let them get you. 
Mike, the fate of your uncle is in your hands. Find a tunnel in the village and hurry to Dr. J's laboratory. Will do, random guy. That's a... it's a pretty unique weapon to have a yo-yo as a weapon. Oh, you're Dr. J's nephew. Here is the tunnel. Good luck. Thanks, guy wearing a weird hat. Oh. Uh, contrary to what I believed when I was younger, that is not a banana in her hand. The, that is her pinky and her thumb extended. I'm the shaman and sister of the island chief. I oh, didn't ask for your life story, lady. Your uncle has was abducted because he found a secret in the lost ruins. I have great hope that you will succeed in rescuing Dr. Jones. Just like your North Star, island sailors look for the Southern Cross. Mike, many wild monsters await you in the dark below. But remember, the magic of the Southern Cross is always on your side. Now begin the test of island courage. Good luck. Ready for some sick-ass tunes? Oh yeah. I, to this day, like 25 years later, I still get this song stuck in my head. On like a weekly basis. It's not like once a year, it's like every couple of days I'll be humming this tune. Like every couple of days. <laughs> that's how ingrained in my soul this is. Wait, I'm a ginger, I don't have soul. Uh, that's how ingrained in my nature. Uh, so I'm, I'm killing slugs. They're not very threatening. But this is, you know, first level. Have some yo-yo. Yo-yo. Uh, star. I always forget what the stars are for, but I will remember shortly. Probably. So you're very limited in your jumping ability. When you're standing still, or like on regular land, you just jump straight up. So it's not very useful. But you can jump over one block. So... Like, if I were to jump to my left right now, I would die. Because this water is deathly water, apparently. <laughs> or maybe Mike is just one of those characters who, uh, can't swim. And he dies instantly upon touching water. More star, yay! So that's a, a mysterious thing. Dr. Jones got abducted because he found a, something in the ruins? And there's monsters down here? What could it be? Go down. Urgh. Um, that's the other thing is, uh... Your movements have to be very calculated, because you need to stop. Like, if I want to go up right now, I gotta stop first, and then go up. So, you gotta, like, stop and plant your feet and go up. I'm not saying I have to let go of the controls or anything, but... It's, uh... He doesn't just have a fluid motion, you know? And any of these green platforms could be switches, so... I usually tend to jump on all of them. Oh. Didn't need that. Don't know why I, uh, went for it. This is video game habits, you know? Monster drops some loot, you want to get the sweet loot! Hmm. Oh yeah, and you can't jump diagonal either, so... It's pretty limited. Oh. That's... This was the wrong way. The room is shaped like a skull. It's ominous. Hmm, nothing? 
Aha! Secret. Ooh, secret ways! Okay. Nothing on those. Alright, I'm relearning. It's been a while since I played this game. Not as long as a while as you might think. I'm, I'm pretty sure I played this a couple years ago. Some torches, eh? Uh, important. Huh? Okay. Huh? Is this the way forward? Or is it still a secret? Oh, this is the way forward. Cool. Just eat up that ominous music. Hmm. Oh, good happy. Yay, more torches. Yay. So basically, the torch uh, is not a, a light, it's you throw fire. So, that's neato. But I only have 48 uses. <laughs> It is difficult to uh, describe just how uh, clunky his movement can be when you're doing something like this. How about Snake? Ah, uh, he's gonna get me. He's gonna get me! He didn't get me! I was wrong. Ooh, can I get more? Empty! Well, I guess they had planned on it. Dun 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 So these guys are kind of like Thwomp type enemies. The snakes. They uh, only command you when they see you. Or when you're on the same vertical or horizontal plane as them. Boss? Yeah. Giant snake boss. Come on, dude, I'm wasting my fire. Yeah. Yeah! I did it! And there is its skeleton. Yeah, the way out. Wow, you've done it! It's gosh dang right I did. Hi, I'm Baboo, Dr. J's assistant. Mike! You know Dr. J has a submarine called sub -C. The ID code of the start of the engine of the sub -C is 1492. I'm, I'm going to take a picture of that, because uh, I might need to remember it, or it might be one of those things where the game just does it for me. But, now I got the picture. Memorized ID code. Oh yeah, it's an item, so. Please, get on board sub in the laboratory! I wish I could tell you more, but I'm afraid of... Of, of what, Babu? Oh god, he just starts over. Hi, I'm Babu! I have no recollection of the conversation that we just had. Poor Babu. Short-term memory loss. <gasps> in the cockpit of sub -Sea. Welcome on board. I am the navigational computer of sub -Sea. Call me Navcom. 
Input the ID code now. ID code 1492. Start engine. Aye aye, Captain. Subsea is ready to launch. All ahead full. Yeah! Bye, everybody! It's been fun knowing you for the last, uh, couple of minutes. Yeah. Number two, dolphins. After a few hours' voyage, the subsea is still cruising on the ocean. Hey, a rock! Quick, 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 quick! Nav, come here, Captain. She is a female dolphin. We'll begin translation. Please find my son. He has disappeared. Captain, may I promise her to find her boy dolphin? No. Please find my son. He has disappeared. <laughs> There's not even dialogue for if you say no. He just says it over again. Aye, aye, Captain. Thank you. Please find my son. Okay. So, uh, screw Dr. J, am I right? Let's just go find a dolphin. I'm gonna have a look around the outside of the island first. I, I feel like there's a secret, maybe? Nope, not that way. The lighter blue is a barrier, I can't go past it. Wouldn't want to be able to explore the whole empty ocean, right? Ba -da -ba -ba -da. Ba -da -ba 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 nope. Alright. I need one of those little white docking things, like this over there, in order to get out. Like that. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. What's going on here? This lighthouse. Hey, mister. Hello, I maintain the lighthouse. So you're looking for a boy dolphin. Sorry, but I have not seen him. As I dwell on the land, and dolphins are not creatures of the land. Oh, please visit my wife at our south cod house. She enjoys company. Oh, this is the shit out of her. So where do I go? I don't know where to go. Why is there bubbles coming out from here? <gasps> Sick. Heart. How does get heart? Uh, right, that's that. Huh? Oh, I will have you, secret. I will have you. Uh, Oh, I know what I'm doing. Wah, 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 wah. E, 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 yeah. Yeah, there's secret walls. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, that doesn't help me. Hmm. Bam. Bam, ba -dum, bam, bam, ba -dum, bam, 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 bam. I guess I don't get this yet. <laughs> Weird. Because I can't go that way. Maybe it's right there. Maybe I go across there. You definitely go through the rocks to get that uh, uh, heart, though. Oh, hey. Hey there, girl. Welcome, welcome. It's so seldom my husband and I get visitors. So, you're looking for a boy dolphin. Sorry, but I have not seen him. But early this morning, I saw a bottle on the beach. I wonder if it's a clue to the lost dolphin. Well, that's not logical at all. That's a really weird, uh... Oh, hey, look, a giant bottle. That's as big as I am. That's a very weird conclusion to come to. So that's why this is here. Okay. But you have to talk to her for the bottle to show up. You got a bottle! There's no way bottle read it! Help, captured by evil aliens. Tell my nephew to use code 1776, Dr. J. Again, I don't think I need to, but I'm gonna take a picture of that. Uh, blep. There we go. Good phone, sit there. Memorize the ID code. Do you want to read it again? No. Navcom here, Captain. Input the ID code now. ID code 1776. Aye, aye, Captain. Submergible. System ready. Please press B button when you want to submerge. 
Yeah! Yeah! Alright! Kicking all the butt! You got a big heart! Your life level is increased! Sack! Alright. And that is a hole in the ground, which means more monsters ahead. Which I'll do next time! But where's the dolphin? Who knows? Will I find him in the hole in the ground? Who knows? I I know, but you know. Tune in next time, and you'll know. Huh, yeah.